Hey guys, I'm going to be talking a little bit about what I'm currently doing with my diet right now. And then after that, I'm going to smash a chicken. And I'm going to see exactly how long it takes me to smash a whole rotisserie chicken right now. This entire rotisserie chicken is sitting in our toaster oven and it smells delicious and I'm hungry and I've ate like nothing today so I can sort of make this fit my macros. I mean, it's not going to, I've only got like 3,000 calories a day right now. So right now my goals is I'm looking to lose about another 30 to 35 pounds. With the wedding coming up, things are gonna get a little hairy around the week of the wedding because I'm gonna be doing a little bit of drinking, but I'm really not too worried about that. But we're gonna have a lot of fun that week. So right now I'm eating about 2,400 to 2,900 calories a day, depending on uh, gym, cardio, what I'm doing throughout the day. This morning, I weighed in at 256 pounds, so things are going fairly well. For my macros, I'm eating 220 grams of protein a day, anywhere from 210 to 260 grams of carbs a day. That's the ratio that I vary depending on the amount of work that I'm doing, physical work that I'm doing. And then my fats are usually right around 90 grams of fat a day. It's probably going to take me another three months to get down to the desired weight. That's including the drinking and lots of eating that I'm going to be doing in Puerto Vallarta. I'm going to get in a strong man so I can really start to throw on that strength to see where I'm at because I'm kind of excited to do a real bulk because all my debulks have been dirty and I've just decided that I need to really commit to this shit instead of half-assing it when I'm bulking like I have been because I diet really easy, that's not a problem. I've never had an issue dieting. Once I started dieting seven years ago, I lost all the weight and I started to bulk back up. It's always been a struggle because I really don't count my food and I just eat whatever the hell that I want and that's an issue because I can't eat whatever the hell that I want because my body doesn't respond very well to eating literally everything in sight. Without further ado, uh, let's make a chicken appear here and let's get smashing. Yeah! I've never really speed ate anything before. So this is going to be interesting. Uh, I've done a few eating challenges, but they've just involved gross shit like raw eggs, which I have no problem eating, but apparently some people do. Um, got my Perrier waters here. I'll start the timer. I'm going to put this lapel mic down. I'll just cue up some music, so let's get this started. Come on and get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. Come on with the come on. Get down with the get down. My deal's not styles we make, never think, we'll break Okay, I can't do this. I'm sorry. This is, no, this is not for me. I tried. I gave it my all. I'm starting to feel sick. I'm not even halfway through this chicken. I was really hungry, and now I'm not hungry anymore. I'm definitely not a speed eater, as I've come to find out. That was miserable. I'll show you how much is left. It's not entirely a bad thing that I can't speed eat a chicken. Chicken was really never something that I binge ate when I used to. It was more like sugary stuff. But yeah, no, it was a good learning experience. Never gonna. I think I might be done with chicken for a bit. That was pretty miserable, guys. That was pretty miserable. I'm glad you guys have stuck with me this far. This was an interesting learning experience. And if you enjoyed the video and all its catastrophic failures, please like, subscribe, comment below. Uh, check out my blog at fatthestack.com. I'm pretty straightforward. I'm pretty honest about stuff. Check out my Instagram. I'm very active there. I try to post several times a day. Anyway, guys. 
We'll see you next time. This has been Russ, signing off and not eating any more chicken.